So this is a simply supported beam with overhand. A is a hinge support, and B is a roller support. Now if we apply a concentrated load somewhere in between A and B, how would this beam deflect? Now let's look at deflected shape. A concentrated load coming down. So we should look at a few points. At point A, or support A, we notice that this point is not moving up, up and down or translate horizontally because it is a hinge support. However, point A rotates by a certain angle here because hinge support allows rotation to occur. And similarly, at point B, a roller support rotation is also allowed. And now the beam deflects into a concave shape, as we can see here. And also we notice that after point B, that part of the beam actually is a straight line. The reason is because that portion of the beam is a free end without any loading, so there will be no bending moment developed within that part of the beam. So along the deformed shape here, there is no control flexural point anywhere. <laughs>